We all desire to see good days in our life. We all desire that life that we live, that we would begin to not just live it, but enjoy it to the fullest. Well, when we open up our Bibles to Psalms 34, verse 11 and 12, it reads there, Come, you children, listen to me. I will teach you the fear of the Lord. Who is the man who desires life and loves many days that he may see good? Who is the man who desires life and many days he would love and that he would see good? Who is that man? Then in verse 13, he says, No, who is the man? He is the man who keeps his tongue from evil and lips from speaking deceit. Keeps his tongue from evil and lips from speaking deceit. We need to understand that the secret to having a good life or a secret to see good days is knowing to control your tongue, is knowing that there is death and life in the power of the tongue. It is so easy to curse, right? It's so easy to get upset when things don't happen right and just speak those negative words. It's so easy to just flare up in that fit of rage against your husband or against your wife. It's so easy to flare up with anger and discipline against your children. But do you know that those words carry power? That those words have an effect, an effect that would either build or destroy. So here he says, Keep your tongue, control your tongue. And what do we control our tongue from? He says, keep your tongue from evil and your lips from speaking deceit. Keep your tongue away from evil. Keep your tongue away from anger, expressing anger. Keep your tongue away from gossiping. Keep your tongue away from negative words that you speak over your family. Keep your tongue away from constant, constant grumbling and bickering. We need to be people who understand that we can enjoy life and see good days when we know how to use our tongue. A wise man listens more, speaks less. We need to understand that God has set this principle for you and me that if we use our tongue wisely, we would enjoy life. But if we use it foolishly, we will bear the consequences of every loose word you and I speak. So we need to make a choice either use our tongue wisely or foolishly. God bless you.